Hello, my name is John from Simply Apple, and welcome to the first ever edition of 3 and Out. This episode of 3 and Out is being recorded on September 15th, 2012. And the first question I should answer is what exactly is 3 and Out? 3 and Out is a series of videos that will be uploaded to my Simply Apple YouTube channel that deal with Apple news, Apple devices, apps, Apple rumors, other technology information, I'll answer some questions, and I'll also share with you some news relevant to Simply Apple itself. These videos, as I said, will be uploaded to my Simply Apple YouTube channel, one every three weeks for 3 and Out. And what's even more is 3 and Out will never be any longer than 3 minutes and 59 seconds. So yes, each episode will never go beyond 3 minutes and 59 seconds. So technically speaking, I could have called this 3 minutes and some odd seconds and out, but I think we all agree 3 and out sounds a lot better. So now that you know what 3 and out is, let's talk about some Apple news. Earlier this week, Apple had an event in which they, they announced a long-awaited iPhone 5. And it appears to be a beautiful device. It has a 4-inch display. It is lighter and thinner than the iPhone 4S. It has a brand new dot connector called Lightning. It has LTE. It is powered by the A6 processor. And there's been some other changes as well. For instance, the headphone jack is now on the bottom of the device, actually by the dot connector. Again, a lot of changes have occurred to the iPhone 5, but yet a lot of things are also the same as they were with previous iPhones. And when the iPhone 5 was announced, you could hear a collective hooray from the Apple fans, and you could also hear a collective boo from the Apple haters. The truth probably falls somewhere in between, but it does look to be a great, great phone, and something else I think we can all agree on is I'm pretty sure the iPhone 5 will break some phone records for sales. The iPhone 5 will be available on September 21st for actual pickup in stores and whatnot, but again, good luck trying to get those because I'm pretty sure those will sell out very, very fast. Not only did Apple talk about the iPhone 5, they also gave an official release date for iOS 6, the new operating system for iOS devices. And that release date will be Wednesday, September 19th, 2012. And I am looking extremely forward to the new iOS 6 and looking forward to updating my iOS devices. There's a lot of great new features that will be part of it. Apple is touting that there will be over 200 new features in iOS 6, and I really can't wait for that. And I'll have some videos on Simply Apple that are related to iOS 6. Again, September 19th. Now, I also must note that it would appear that iOS 6 will not be compatible with all iOS devices. For instance, the original iPad will not be able to download iOS 6. But more information on that as it becomes available. Well, we have reached the end of the first ever edition of 3 and I hope you've enjoyed it. And until next time, this is John from Simply Apple.